Hello, hello. Um, today I'm gonna be talking uh, quickly about doing a quick demo. Demo, I should say, about how to uh, decrypt Proton Mail messages in iOS. Okay, it's super easy. It's already implemented in I, uh, um, iLeap, and uh, I'm gonna show you how to how to do that. It's uh, again, it's super easy. So let me let me show you. So the first thing you need to do is go and read here. I have a link for you. Read this blog post here from let me let me go here from um, Matthew Regneri. Um super cool dude he actually explains that he has uh, shared some of his knowledge and doing some iLeap uh, artifacts in the past so I'm really th thankful his, for his research this implementation wouldn't exist without him okay so you read the blog post here I'm gonna put it in the notes and then you need a few things what do you need so as you see here in the list you need to have a full file system extraction from your targeted iOS device. Okay, you can use CheckRain or third party vendor tools, right? Pay tools. Then you need to extract and decrypt, decrypt the keychain. There's a link for that too, will be in the notes. Download iLeap, install the dependencies, and then uh, put the keychain where it needs to go and just run iLeap. So it's, it's really easy. So let me show you. What you're going to do is you're going to go to the iLeap repository, get that code. Just download uh, that zip, okay? You're gonna decompress it, so your files are where you want them to be. So let's go to that directory real quick, and here it is, right? So we're gonna open it, and then there you will see uh, all the code for Eile. So we need to put the keychain where it needs to be. So you go to the scripts uh, directory, you're gonna open that, and then you're gonna go to the keychain directory. And what you're gonna do is you're gonna take the keychain that you extracted from your device um, that's decrypted, and the, the link in the notes will explain how to do that. And then you take that decrypted or decoded um, uh, keychain and you drop it there on the on the keychain directory in Ailey. All right, so you're like 99% done. <laughs> now the next thing is to uh, you know execute uh, the script to actually do that that decryption for you. So I'm gonna go, I'm gonna open a uh, terminal window so I could, uh, you know, just call Python and call the script to run it. So I'm gonna open my terminal and then now I'm gonna go and I'm gonna look for um, Python, call the interpreter and then the GUI version. Okay, so let's scroll, there it goes, hit enter and that'll give you the graphical interface for Eile. So what we do is we're gonna select the extraction, the full file system extraction, target extraction. I have it right here, zip file. And then you're gonna browse to where you want that output. So I'm gonna put it in the desktop so it's easy, easy to find. Um, I'm gonna deselect all the other artifacts and just go with the one that I care about for this demo, which is the Proton Mail one. It's right there, so you click on it, it's active and you hit process and you can see here it says executing completed super quick and let's open that report you'll see on the left it says proton mail decrypted emails so um, we're gonna go to script run log you see the same kind of output or the same output you saw there in the previous screen and the files that were processed right some plists that are needed for that decryption the database SQL database that has the actual PGP encrypted messages and the like and now we open it and you can see sender right from and to you can see the title of the different messages that were coming in right if you go to the uh, body section you can see their decrypted messages as as needed see and you can actually read them out um, I, I really want to uh, thank uh, Kate Kane for doing the uh, the test data for this demonstration and for doing work with me on on implementing Matthew's uh, work in, in iLeap. So thanks to Matthew for doing the heavy lifting and thanks for to Kate uh, work together in implementing this. If you go um, to the different files that were extracted by the script, you will see there the database. And let's open it so you can confirm what I'm talking about. I'm gonna open that database and you will see if you go to the messages uh, table, well, the good stuff is, you will see there the different uh, data in its encrypted form, 
okay? So let's go to the proper blob. You can go into the right and you see there in C body and look at that. That's the, it says begin PGP message and it's all the messages that are encrypted, okay? So if you go here and make it a little bit bigger so you can see it better, um, we pretty much went, well, not pretty much, what we did was <laughs> we went from this thing here, right? That encrypted uh, piece of PGP, you know, um, ASCII uh, values to this, you know, actual ASCII that you can read and make sense of it. All right. So hopefully that uh, made sense. How we went uh, about doing that conversion is super easy. Again, you go from from having PGP to the encrypted the decrypted data. The only things you need is your extraction and your keychain, and that's it. And you will be good to go. Um, any questions, hit me up on Twitter. I will have all those uh, links in the description uh, below the video. And uh, hopefully this helps. Um, take care and uh, have a good day.